We're going to church. We're going to church. <laughs> and we've got chili in the back seat. Because after church, we're going to a party. Uh, some of our friends from church are throwing a party because uh, it's one person's birthday and one person is going away. So it's a dual reasonings party. And everybody's bringing something tasty and Julia made the most delicious chili. Coffee, 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 clouds. <laughs> <laughs> I'm driving now. Get those clouds. We're surrounded by perfect clouds. <laughs> or puffy, puffy, puffy clouds. Wow. I love this bird. The sky. Hey, internet. It's Wednesday night, which feels like Friday night because we're not working at all the rest of this week. Here we are at the grocery store, getting hit by red cars. Good morning, Thursday. The chiropractor gave me this awesome brace to put on my, to keep my back straight or make it start being straight or something. So, I uh, love you. Um, so now I wear that all the time, but especially when I'm like driving or whatever. If I'm, he said, if you're sitting for a long time, or standing for a long time, or lifting for a long time, or walking for a long time, if I'm doing anything for a long time, except for laying down. It's Thursday morning, and we are embarking on a mystery journey. I honestly don't know where we're going. For my birthday, I wanted Julia to take me away. She said, what do you want for your birthday? And I said, I would just want to go away with you. Get away, whisk me away. So now she planned this secret trip and we're leaving this morning. I still don't know where we're going, except that the GPS just, she punched it in. I didn't see the address, but the GPS says we'll arrive at four o'clock. So it's about four hours away. Here we go. Vroom. You're not actually right now. <laughs> Vroom. Look at the clouds. Pleasant trekking. Wow. We're going into one of the three tunnels that the turnpike has. Phew. Well, we made it to the dingy hotel. Just kidding. Look at this humongous, ginormous. I've never stayed in a hotel this huge before. I already set up, we're doing a time lapse of the awesome, um, but it's bigger than our apartment. <laughs> Vastly bigger. <laughs> and then there's a, a bathroom and a bedroom back there. It's awesome! Baltimore. That's right, the secret location is Baltimore in this secret, uh, gigantic hotel that nobody else knows about. We're on the 29th floor is where our room is. I'm gonna go explore the hotel. Since there's so many floors, there's like ballrooms and stuff. We're gonna just see if we can peek in those. <laughs> what? Hi. It's a beehive. Mmm, <laughs> books. We are way too underclassed for this place. <laughs> oh, there's peppermints on the table. This tapestry reminds us of Narnia. G4. Glenn. Julia was noting that they look like fairy houses. This is the bathroom inside this hotel. We finished the grand tour of Fancyland. Fancyland, yeah. <laughs> we very successfully underclassed everything. <laughs> the Baltimore Castle. Here's this cute thing. It's actually one bar. Here's my hand. We're in Barnes and Noble. Shh, it's a bookstore. And we think that this building used to be a factory because look at these huge uh, smokestacks. You know, we say to save money on eating out, we uh, brought a bunch of food, but we forgot to bring these silverware. So Julia is spreading this dip on <laughs> the hot dog bun using a carrot. This is the fanciest hotel room I've ever been in. And we're sitting here eating microwaved hot dogs. 
Look how good we look. We're going out, I don't know where. Julia made reservations somewhere. Someone's getting up. It is a magician. We're about to see the magician. We had the most incredible time at Illusions. Illusions starring Spencer Horseman. Horseman. He, oh my goodness, it was awesome. He did some amazing things. Uh, I would have filmed it, but we weren't allowed, and I don't like to break rules. He pulled a $20 bill that I had signed out of the inside of an orange. And, um, sorry, baby. He, uh, made coins pass through solid plexiglass <laughs> without, like, it wasn't covered. Like, he just did it, and we watched it happen. It was awesome. We're leaving Baltimore. You sound like the elevator. Going down. <laughs> Going up. Food lion. It's misty. Magical. Misty. <laughs> the um, ambiance is kind of ruined by the windshield wipers. Okay, sorry. The misty mountain. We're pulling up into Bellevue and so we're home and it was an awesome trip. Thank you, Julia, for that amazing escape from Pittsburgh. So we're home and we'll end the video here. Uh, enjoy this time lapse from Baltimore. Good night.